before we start this video, I want to tell you one thing. My album is now online. It's called When It Rains. Uh, and it's basically the story of all the things that you don't see in the vlogs. The things that happened to me last year with all my injuries. All the negative stuff. <laughs> if you're down for that, go listen to the album and then you know, you know everything. Just stream it. Just stream the hell out of it. And then uh, we'll see where it ends. Okay, thank you. Let's go on with the video now. Hello, my name is Casimir Smeet and this my is Jackass. Hello, I'm Casimir <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Look us. Hey! Hello guys, it is week number two ready to up the work rate we have to be working towards full routines this week not entirely full routines but like a structured routine uh, with basic lines in between for example first two lines are the real lines then two basic lines and then uh, my double twist and my triple twist those are those are real lines uh, but those are really easy for me the rest of the group is also upping the intensity this week. Epke has done some crazy shit already. And he definitely needs to because this World Cup circuit for him is so important. This is his last chance to, to make the Olympics. And he's pretty much just up against Miyachi at this point. So it's gonna be a crazy battle between those two. There's uh, one more chance to uh, qualify for the Olympics in Tokyo through the World Cup cycle. There's a total of eight World Cups. There are three more left. My uh, competitor Hidetachi Miyachi uh, is doing a great job because he won three already and I've won two. If I want to beat him, I definitely have to win one. And when we both uh, uh, won three times, uh -huh. uh, then we're equal and then they will look at the best average of those three results. So mm -hmm. they're looking at the scores and uh, so it's not only uh, important to win, but to win with a really good score to get your efforts up. It's not like uh, try to win and do a little bit easy routine or something. I just have to go big all the time. I'm gonna need a 15 plus probably. So we have a few weeks left to prepare for Melbourne, the first one, and it's getting better and better. So I hope uh, it will continue like this. So this day I wasn't really feeling all that good. Lots of pain in my throat and just a stuffy nose. Slept for like nine hours, but I woke up super exhausted. Still tried to push floor. I got some good turns in, but the overall feeling was just pretty rough. But today though, today we have redemption day. Freaking did almost full routine already. Just my full routine without the three and a half punch full. Uh, and then I also did the two and a half punch one and a half instead of the two and a half double because it didn't really feel that good. Upon watching it back, it actually looked pretty decent. Like it was, it was actually doable. But uh, coordination wise, like in, in routine itself, it's, it's still kind of tough. I'm gonna give it one more go though. It's so heavy, it's insane. Oh, it hurts so much. Oh, and then Hyper was pretty cool too. Look at this, I did the cool turn. I did the Coleman into a tap and then immediately to the Gaylord. Oh crap, that's a funny name. Why, why would someone name it a Gaylord? Because it was Mitch Gaylord's last name, you stupid ass. But it was honestly pretty cool. Okay, thank you, that's the end of the video. Bye!